I, I love art and I, I, I get all enthused over doing one thing and then I'll stop that a few minutes and decide I'm going to do something else. So all these years I have painted with with enthusiasm from nature and from from the people around me. The thing that inspired me the most, I feel, is my mother. Because she had the art in her. and She was never uh, advanced into to actually studying art, but she felt the art. I work in all mediums, uh, watercolor, acrylics, oil, uh, fabrics, um, threads, yarns. My doll making has been um, going on for many, many, many years. Uh, when I had my dress shop, I would make dolls for display and eventually they would sell. One of my favorites is a wizard and she, he was inspired by my granddaughter. She grew up loving all the wizards and the dragons and, and all that and she um, was a big influence on me as well. I was pretty much an influence on her as well. In 207, uh, Mrs. Bush decided that she would do all the Christmas ornaments that particular year on all the national parks of the U.S. They approached each park and asked them to find someone in the community that would paint a scene of the war, uh, of the Revolutionary War. Cal Pence came up to the Carolina Foothills Artisan where I am a member and asked the director if she knew of anyone in this community that could paint uh, an ornament as they wanted it painted. And she said, right away, she said, yes, I do. And she called me, asked me, and I was so impressed and so excited. I said, yes, I sure will, because that's quite an honor. I did the scene of the horses, two horses, and the generals. And I did a background of the Cowpens Battleground on the back side of the ball. I also received an invitation uh, and an appreciation from Mrs. Bush. And then uh, after the ball was sent back, I had another invitation to come to a reception at the White House with uh, Mrs. Bush and with all the other artists. There were some, probably near 500 artists there. Art is one of the most important things that we could possibly invest in. It shows the people, different artists see different things. I can look out and see a tree and its limbs and its leaves. Another artist would look out and see just the basics you know, the, just the, the outline of the tree, which is fine. I think every artist has the opportunity to look, look, see, see deep into what, what's out there. And I think if we didn't have art, what would this world be like? Because the artists are looking through artist eyes all the time. And that helps other people see what the artists see.